this is the first time that our families are on campus, uh, getting tours, getting a uh, sense for the lay of the land, the campus layout, and understanding where their students will be taking instruction uh, starting on, on Wednesday. Although the campus might not look 100% complete, what we're focusing on is teacher and student relationships, supporting our families, giving them the things that they need to recover learning loss that might have taken place during distance learning, and really supporting them socially and emotionally as they transition into high school. So we're really excited because it's a brand new school. It's very different, the layout here, than most other schools. So she's really excited about that. One, I like to see the, I like to know the staff, the faculty, and kind of see how they are, how they interact with the students. We'll have roughly 50 teachers and we have about 100 total staff members um, and we have 1,200 students. I think it's important that the community has a part in naming a lot of what makes up Justin Garza. They were instrumental in getting the school named after the legendary Justin Garza who was a local hero for Central Unified. And once that name was selected, we put out to the community some choices for mascots. And we wanted to have mascots typically with some alliteration uh, with the G. Uh, we threw out some options such as the Giants and the Guardians was one of the, uh, the overwhelming uh, favorite in that uh, voting process. We'll kick off our first day of school with the rally, uh, trying to set the tone for what our vision is, for what it means to be a Guardian um, as they start off their school year.